All right, all right, all right, all right. Cheers, everyone. It's time. It's time for Operation Ashes and Temples. Base defense. Let's go. Delta section, report. Delta section, report. Finally. Delta section. It looks like your emergency generators are back online. And oh, oh shh. Delta, whatever this attack is, you're right in the crosshairs. We've got perimeter alerts triggering from all sides. It looks like you've got flyers coming through the cavern near the rear guard station. Plus, you've got a whole wall of heat signatures coming down through the vents in the ceiling above you. Whoever breached our internal security locked down the door system separating you from the rest of the base. Once we get the doors open again, we can start sending reinforcements through, but that might take some time. Right now, it looks like the closest alarms being triggered are in the vents above you. Keep an eye out for any indications of movement. Delta okay. section, you have to hold the line. The future of XCOM is counting on you. Thanks, Bradford. I hope you were here, to be honest. Okay, so we are watching for these uh, crumbles from the ceiling. We know that the enemies will pop um, up in there. And we'll have like heavy floaters and stuff flying, flying from here. Um, uh, we have the top three soldiers from the roster, which I have been keeping ready. So we have Baskinger, we have Old Grog, and we have um, Fallen Yumi here. In addition to that, we have random uh, base staff members. Uh, looks like they are also in the not created equally roulette. So we got 55 offense on this guy and very low will. Very, very bad. Uh, we got 70 offense on this guy and high will. So this guy is alright. Uh, so we have two of these rookies with our, uh, with our colonels here. This guy, they are carrying two grenades. So that's good. Uh, for some reason they are carrying frag grenades. I have no idea why that is, but... Uh, uh, what you could do is just put these guys as uh, as uh, shield uh, as uh, meat shields in there. But uh, if we look at the place, we know that there's someone dropping in here, there's someone dropping in the center, there's someone dropping in here, and there's someone dropping in there. Um, I want my sniper in a position where they can double tap everything, um, and then eventually we'll start moving this way. Oh, right, there's one uh, one coming on this side as well. It's a good thing I remembered. Hmm, okay. Yeah, one will come in there that we can't really touch now. So it will be coming. So if I... Let's see. Have to take into account the close combat specialist as well. Uh, I'm thinking that will I... I've, I don't really want to spend the run and gun in the first turn. First turn, so maybe... Maybe just doing these guys here. So it looks like if someone drops in there, someone in there, this position would give me... Good shots on them and possibly close combat specialist as well. And uh, they have a lightning... Lightning reflexes to get away from them as well. Then I think I will have you. New position confirmed. I will have you jumping up in here uh, to have uh, have shots on them and also getting further from that door uh, while still having Overwatch. Was the flyers coming from here? Like I would just could just let them come in and be like here instead. Uh, that thing dropping in here, whatever it is. If it drops in this corner and not there, it might have cover against my shots. So I think way. I will take the mech here to do the Overwatch shots on it. The, the rookie here. Let's move Position them. Confirmed. Move them here. They can do overwatch shots from there. This guy. This guy might be our eyes. 
eyes on that side. I want them to shoot. Mm, yeah, they, they need the height bonuses. So I think they might be in a good spot already. They are protected from that side and this side. Uh, so let's overwatch from there. You... If I keep you in place, whoever comes from there... I think I'll set my position for the double tap next turn. Instead of uh, overwatching. Instead of overwatching, so... Whoever comes from there, we could shoot it through this, like this gap as well. Mm, I want to be able to fire that one as well, so maybe we'll just fly. Mm, I would like to get them in cover. Cover next turn. So I think I I think I want to land in here. Come in here and just take the flights. Take the flights off. It's a little bit awkward to see, I think that's the spot. Yeah. Good. Okay. Alright, aliens. Let's dance. Oh, I missed this one. Target remains. That Mechtoid is annoying. That Commander is annoying. Normal Sectoid there is good. Two Mechtoids, fuck. You got fresh reinforcements standing by, Commander. The bad news is we drain the auxiliary power banks while holding the doors open. It's going to take some time to reroute power. Okay, Sul and Sheen are choice. Which is great. So they can double tap that. Uh, they can double tap that Mechtoid. Uh, did the Mechtoid go on Overwatch? I don't think they went on Overwatch. Okay. Uh, normal sector is great. That like, this is lucky. These these could be anything. These three sectors here could be anything. The one sector commander in the back is kind of kind of annoying. But, uh, but yeah, luckily we get some of these normal ones as well, so it's not completely. Because uh, dealing with 48 hit points is pretty, <laughs> pretty nasty. Um, I was thinking I would get the close combat specialist with, uh, with our Kai, but we didn't. Uh, we also got two more, two more uh, staff members here. Uh, pretty average, minus 5 on the aim. Yeah, not not lucky with their not created equal things. Uh, I think one of them should just go and kill this sectoid. Uh, there now. That was also a check for the overwatch. <laughs> And now they will be our eyes on this side as well. Uh, do we have more of those crumbles anywhere? They said flyers coming in, so we are probably getting those. Simba Kuba, indeed. That is a that is a good name. That is a good name. Um, okay, so sectoid, sectoid. Moving out. Uh, let's wait with the grenades. I would like to shoot twice, but I don't want to stand in the open. Uh, I think you will take your 80% shots. Or should I leave, save your grenade as well? Mm. 
So the sector commander is coming from here. Like, I I could put this guy as a bait, so that maybe the sector commander just mind controls him instead of anything else. I think they were maybe back here. I didn't quite see where they were. If I see them, I could go with them. So if I put them like here, On my way. if I see the sector commander, I could do something. But I will try to kill this one. It's action. Good job, rookies. Or staff. Um, I don't want like flanking shots from sectoids. So we'll probably take care of that. Do like a double tap. Uh, Let's do a headshot there to maximize the damage, and then double tap the sectoid behind me. Nice crits, very nice. Mm. Yeah, I, I just want this guy dead. It's unnecessary. Unnecessary booster or uh, doing some... Uh, Annoying things there. Um, I'm thinking about the bullet swarm. Bullet swarm because we have heat ammo. Heat ammo, but um, maybe I'll do one shot and see what I do after that. On the other hand, if I move closer, it would be a sure shot. Um, the sector commander like jumps in and comes somewhere in here. I want to be able to take care of it. I think I have a kill on this one. Good run and gun there as well. Or like be in here, but then they they might they might might control you, which I don't like. Don't really want to stay there either. Can't really get critical on them, but with the heavy. With the heat ammo, I could kill that one. And then we have you possibly overwatching. Possibly overwatching for the sectoid commander. Yeah, this would be otherwise, but uh, since the sectoid commander came there, I don't really like that. Uh, let's just. Double check one more time for the crumbles. Not on this side, anything in here. I uh, don't see anything. Yeah, I don't see anything, so it should be good. Mm, we can run and gun quite far. So I think I'll just go behind it. And from here we can run and gun for the sector commander. And I'm really unlucky this would do only seven and I don't want that, so let's do it let's do rapid fire so it dies for sure. And then do you see the okay but you can go forward and uh, get a shot on that guy as well. You can like drop in here. Drop in here, I have a shot on that guy, so then... Uh, you will only do three or four. I think I will see, see how this goes. If I just bullet swarm. Yeah, I think it's pretty good. Because uh, there will be no one shooting this heavy, we can take these shots. Nice. Heat ammo is amazing. 
That's why I wanted Zul and Sheener as the fourth soldier, instead of the Assault, who will be coming next, because we have the heat ammo. So uh, all that, all that worked really brilliantly. Um, okay. I think I will keep you where you are. And if the if the sectoid commander climbs up here, let me see. Could I? I think it's back here, but I think it's I think it's too aggressive to go for it. But I could put um, hmm, Overwatch or proximity grenade. If it's if it's back there, it can come up this pipe and climb like here. D -d 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 -d, so it we might get a visual on it, like if we stand in here. On my way. Scanning. So let's see if we do. I see you, Commander. Overwatch. I hear you, Commander. You hear Sectoid that? Commander. Okay, that's beautiful. Perfect. It didn't have a turn. And uh, let's see, do we have crumbles? We have no crumbles, I think. We will be getting the flyers from this side. But it's fine. Okay. Is the pillar on the way? The pillar is on the way, okay. I want this rookie here to keep an eye on this side. And... I think I will go and rapid fire this guy's ass. Just uh, delete it. Didn't even need the rapid fire. Okay, this is turn to reload. Uh, the flyers are coming, but I want to keep. I want to move the mech towards the I'm on it, commander. mech towards the right hand side from the camera angle right here. Um, I said the flyers will be coming in, but I think I will Ready use this to turn to reload. Uh, just in case they do come in, let's overwatch with you. You will be seeing them when they come. So let's overwatch with you as well. Let's move you a little bit. Let's let's get you on a better position on to have a high advantage shots. We were prepared for this. Like the base defense is, uh, it's very hard. It's not it's not over, and uh, kind of a uh, lot of things can happen here. But the the mission is mission is made in a way that this comes as a surprise. So that you wouldn't necessarily have your best guys, and you wouldn't necessarily have all uh, all the things you want. Heading there now. So kind of uh, as I have my colonels here, uh, colonels here, we are kind of in a really good spot in dealing with this. But uh, we we start to get these surprises now. So uh, well, not surprises, but uh, so soon we will be sandwiched between the flyers and these guys. Yeah, we are getting more and more in here. Okay, we need to move. We need to get guys on that side, while still somehow handling this side as well. So I think this might be the turn where we move. Yeah, let's get the mech there. Mech can handle them pretty well. Uh, you can handle a lot. You can handle a lot, especially with your uh, close combat specialist if they... They would be coming from here, but if they come from the top, uh, 
who can't do much this turn. I think I will use this turn to change position and just reload. Um, you will be our eyes in the back. Your ammo is not that important, but I will still reload you. Uh, I want you to be able to double tap all these things here next turn. Uh, so you might come in here and just shoot those guys. Yeah, let's get you in position to take shots on the platform next turn. And... I might need your shots or grenades or something in there, so I'm taking you here as well. Heading out. And this guy... This guy can come and contribute. Contributing to all the watches in here. I think that's alright. If things surprise us from the other side, like cyber discs and stuff, things can get uh, kind of nasty. We're picking up activity in the ventilation system near the mech bay, Commander. Yeah, let's see what we get. Chrysalid. Sector is good. Another chrysalid, that's fine. Okay, nothing from here yet. Okay, that's all good. We can handle these really easily. Uh, no double tap for you as that one died. So I think I will get you in position to shoot others in here. Uh, Sector is an easy kill. Affirmative, Commander. So let's get it for the rookie. Or for the staff guy. That's one of the things I really, really wished in this one. For that uh, you get these uh, staff members and you would maybe like get to select one of them or even get all of them as soldiers after this. Uh, that would have been brilliant in my mind. On my way. Okay, let's take care of that. Easy peasy. That was squeezy. X-ray neutralized. In Long War, you do get them if they survive. I haven't played Long War, at least uh, not, not this mission, but uh, that's awesome if they did that. That's fantastic. Affirmative. Uh, let's use this turn to reload. Reloaded. Uh, let's keep the mech here ready to shoot whatever comes from this side as well, but still able to join this side as well. So they are kind of in an okay spot for that. I'm on the move. Let's see what happens. Let's reload you this turn. We will be getting stuff from here, so we might need like your grenades. You are one of the better shots as well. Okay. I think I will get you on this side. Uh, let's move. Let's move you to the upper platform in case we do need to start shooting. Uh, reload you. Overwatch. Overwatch if we get those flyers. We're picking up airborne hostiles moving on the rear guard station, Commander. Okay. I'm not sure the alien what do we get? can reach that area. They may be limited to aerial units. Normal floater, fantastic. Normal floater, fantastic. Cyber disc, fuck. <laughs> Oh shit, of course. Of course. Yeah, I should have remembered it's this much. Oh shit, seekers are kinda nasty actually. Oh, if I remembered this, I would have just barked a heavy here, but I didn't. Um Yeah. Yeah, that is that is not great. Do we have crumples on this side already? No. Yeah, this is uh This is not great. I I didn't remember it was that many.
Understood. Moving out. We need that heat ammo. Let's do this. And we need those rockets. Seekers are nasty. Let's run, uh, let's run this guy in as well. Leave this guy as bait or no? Flying here. The tr oh, that's floater. Okay. Negative damage on target. Now they see us, so, but uh, they don't have movements to come and shoot us. That's why I moved into positions I moved in. Uh, okay. I think some of them, I think they went down there. Let's see. Mm. Nah, they, they might be just floating. One is there, something is there, I mean. We don't know where the, where the seekers are. They might have stayed, like some might, might have stayed back there weirdly. Uh, I don't want to stay too close here. Um, I think we are overwatching because we can't double tap. Uh, you need to reload for your bullet swarm next turn, sadly. Uh, any crumbles here? Not immediately, but probably happening quite soon. you crit that for six on dead about that l2 is pretty good two bit 55 aim is fantastic Pillars here are a little bit annoying. Hmm. 
We kill the floater and then we throw a proximity grenade in there. On the door. of stuff coming coming from there kind of like that placing proximity mine I don't know how they how they shot it like inside the I think we I think we might need some uh, gunfire coming this way so let's move uh, let's move one of the staff members here as well let's keep one here as our eyes and then uh, then we hope for the best we might get a kill Missed the target not quite. Does it have a shot? Okay, this is acceptable. Nice miss. Good dodge. Seeker went to stealth mode. Okay, good. Very nice. Very good. Uh, so that thing is dead. Sadly, our positioning because the, the the cyber disc went in a position that it's hiding behind this pillar, so we can't double tap it. Very clever. Two seekers, two seekers in there. Wonder if I can get visual from here or not. Don't really like the health cover. Health cover in there, but we'll take it if we need to. I can rapid fire that thing quite. Brutally. With some assist we would kill it. I'm on it, Commander. Oh, there's Seeker right here. The other one went into stealth on the other side. Did 
I have a plating? I didn't take shitting plating. Sitting plating, I keep saying shitting plating, but whatever. Uh, it would have helped with strangulation. Does the Titan armor help with that? It helps against fire, but I think they can still take us. I like I like to say it's shitting, it's much better. Much better than any Oh! I didn't know that the close combat specially triggers like that. Once again, accidental genius wins the game. That's awesome. That's good to know for the Seekers. On the move. Mm, aha. Okay, more more guys coming from here. Quite a lot, actually. <sighs> that will be tough. That will be tough. So we have like a floater seeker at least. It was two cyber discs, not three, I think. Yeah, four enemies coming from here. Hmm. I think whatever I do, I can't reach them from here. Uh, but your Overwatch is like really good, so I will I will kill the Cyber Disc with you. I'm about to start keeping score. I know. Nice shot. Well, wasted the Overwatch on a drone, but whatever. Hostile target neutralized. Mutan. Mutan is fine. Another Mutan, okay. Nice shot from the staff guy. Three mutons. Okay, all mutons. Berserker? Yeah. Okay. We're not picking up any additional contacts near the command center. I think you've cleared that area out, Commander. I think there's one seeker still. What are you talking about, Bradford? I think there's a seeker in here. It was two seekers. You don't you don't count that in? We didn't kill it in any way, I think. All uh, oh right, they wouldn't pick it up in the scans. That's true. Okay, but we we don't care about it that much. I think there's also one floater. Uh, okay, so that's uh, that's a lot of heat coming our way, but we are kind of fine with it. We're kind of fine with it. I'm on the move. Heading out. So let's see, they can like run or run or run, like come in here or here or here. That's the closest one. Everyone else will kind of run and they will have to come to this this middle part. 
or stay where they are this turn. This is the only one who can get like it can dash like up in here or something, but it can't get can't get far. I'm on the move. Let's back you up. We want to be able to shoot through this. Or shoot them when they come up. We could even just be here. It's a risky position. I'm on my way. Watching there. I'm on the move. I'd like to shoot. Uh, they come down here. Like up in here, it will be a little bit trickier to deal with. If they would climb these, it would be great, but I'm not sure if they do. too much heat to go and take all those shots. Um, yeah, the sniper is a little bit out of it. Out of it right now. Quiet. Do you hear something? Still don't know where the seeker is. It will appear at some point. I said like they they have to like pile up in this area apart from the one guy on this side. So they will have to appear somewhere in here. Here they could see us from there if we go too close to the edge. Mm. I want you on the, on here at some point, but I think I will just overwatch with the plasma rifle now. And if the seeker pops up in here, it will hopefully eat these guys instead of us. I'm most worried about them just popping down in here somehow. So kind of somehow, somehow, maybe I need to put actually, you know what, you know what, let's put, uh, let's put you, let's put you down here. Uh, they might see an overwatch doing it, I'm but, uh, let's put some hunger down in this corner, so they will have, they will have eyes on the next turn then. Wow, okay, where you are. Let's see what happens. And actually you will... You will get closer. Let's forget about uh, Seeker that is somewhere in there. 
I know it was zero mutants and berserkers. So four mutants and berserker out into wild. Blood call. Okay. That's what I was thinking that they will dash in here from the sides like that. I think that one has a flanking shot on the rookie if they take it. Okay, I think they are running in here. Okay, two blood calls there. Okay, that gave us a lot of information. That gave us a lot of information. Window broken. Circle is here, the mission is in here. Okay, so they kinda kinda did what I what I expected them to do, but not exactly. <laughs> oh, I think that maybe the mutant dashed in here somewhere. Yeah, I think it's in this... No, it's not in that corner. So it's stuff in there. Uh, you don't see the mutant that ran in here, which is odd. I heard the blood calls here, but... Uh, it seems that there's someone in this corner, in like weirdly just here. Like in the middle. Standing in the middle there. It's kind of odd. Another one here. So there's three of them right here. Two mutants here. One is here. Mutant is here in here somewhere, I want to know where it is. I'm on the move. So you will drop down and tell us. Okay. Uh, and two guys in here. We do have a grenade that we are not using on anything. So we could proximity grenade those mutants there somehow. So let's say we kill Let's say we kill three mutants, that would be one mutant and a berserker. And then seeker somewhere. See, can we can we do some sort of proximity grenade from up here? We'll do it on the berserker. You could you could set yourself up for shooting them in the next turn by coming like in here. Uh, if we kill the mutants, the berserker. We could feed the feed the staff guy to them. Maybe grenade and finish this guy with the pistol. This guy a grenadier. He were. We 
do that and then get you in position, finish with... Uh, this could be your position, or even... Let's do aggressive, I think. Uh, the proximity grenade, like if we do it from... Maybe from here. Ah, oh, one of them was an overwatch. Fuck. My position is compromised. The other one might be as well. Okay. No, the other one was not. Okay, that's good. Okay, so we can do we can do proximity grenade in a way that it affects every one of them. Like that. It was okay if we took the shot, it would be like 8 damage on the mech, but uh, it's fine. Mm. There now. Let's get you down there. That's okay. The Berserker is not dying unless I Go. I can go and rapid fire it actually. And then that would leave only one mute on, and uh, we need to deal with this guy somehow. Uh, I wonder if I could chuck a grenade from here. If the berserker dies, this guy could throw a grenade, or I could just like take this guy, make them a bait for the berserker. I think if I, if I come like here, I could throw a grenade and then we would save the... Save you to do something else. I think your action might be to go for that one. And just in case the other mutant is somewhere, this would eat... Uh, this would eat uh, Overwatch. I activated the run and gun because it gives me the critical bonus. Uh, okay, so we are hitting it. We are hitting it, but we are not critting it. But let's say we do... We'll do like 7. We'll go down to 5 on average. It's okay. And this should trigger the close combat specialist as well, which might kill it. Yep. Oh! They panicked! <laughs> they panicked, but they took the close combat specialist still. Where are you going? <laughs> oh, these intimidate panics are getting like, what the hell? Like, everyone. Everyone is just panicking. Moving. We we need those melts on everyone. Um okay, so you could do 81 there or kill it with grenade. Do we have a guaranteed kill on it? And we still have mutant somewhere. That would enable me to me to go uh, go to cover here. Or whatever is happening then after this. Uh why take a why take a chance? 
One meets on then. I'm on it, Commander. Affirmative. Covering now. Overwatch. Commander, we're picking up contacts moving through the forward access tunnel ventilation system. Okay, all the way from there. The meets on is. Oh, Seeker. Okay, chrysalid. Chrysalid, chrysalid. Chrysalid. Okay. So Seeker came in here and uh, strangled this guy, so we finally know where the Seeker is. That's good. There were four mutants, so I'm I have killed one, two, one, two, and three. So there's still one mutant somewhere, right? Yes. And I mean, somehow killed this one. Somehow killed this one in here. So I think I will take care of that with the mech. Precision particle cannon surgery coming up. Job, bro. Hostile neutralized. Heading there now. I'm on my way. Aha. Ooh, nice. Job, job staff member, man. Don't die to chrysalids now. Already there. I think there might still be one floater somewhere in the back, uh, unless it died to the Overwatch or something at some point. I'm not sure. You could be eyes on this okay, side. Checking out. On the move. All, all two tiles. They're catching your breath. I feel, Commander. Target. All right. That was pretty, pretty cool. Uh, camera angle there. Taking care of. Heading there now. The defense is going great. I think more or less the only danger really have been uh, triggering one mutant overwatch shot. I think that was the only thing that's. Uh, Right, and uh, cre uh, the cyberdisc hey, shooting, yeah. shooting one rookie, but that missed. Ready to engage. I think those are, those are the only ones we have. Uh, Reload complete. We have taken. Ichu. Gatova. I'm watching. I'm on it. Affirmative, Commander. 
two chrysalids are running our way. Overwatch. Come get some. Negative damage. Perfect. Moving out. I think there's fourth one somewhere. Uh, we will get stuff in here soon, so we're gonna f need to keep on moving. Efforts. I'm on my way. Thinking I will think I will grenade it. Grenade it just to get uh, just to get these guys overwatching for the last one. Hey, they gained promotion. Nice. Uh, let's reload you this turn. Scanning. Come get some. On Overwatch. Commander, we're picking up a steady increase in alien activity near the forward. Oh, now they are coming from there. Looks like they're concentrating a force there. I'd get okay. pricked. Drone and drone. Commander Sectoid. Cyber disk, okay. We've got zero new contacts near the mech bay, Commander. We should probably focus our efforts elsewhere. Zero new contacts. If my accounts are correct, there is a chrysalid. Chrysalid still there. Okay, not bad. Cyber is Commander, obviously. Not great, but... Uh, uh, I got commander, sector commander in the base assault. They are really far from us. Поехали. Is the chrysalid here somewhere or not? Or did I did I mess up the count? I might have messed up the count as well. Maybe it was only free. Location confirmed.
Next turn. Moving out. Mm, let's leave you on Overwatch if the if if it was for Chrysalis. I feel, Commander. Good to go. We load you. Listen. It looks like this is the last of them, Commander. We're not picking up any additional contact. Two commanders we in total. HQ will be secure. Mechzoid. Okay. Okay. That's a lot of them. Cyberdis can can just fly up. I think it's best to wait and uh have the rookies as our eyes. Moving to position. Rookies as our eyes and just have them have them appear in here. Already there. Completely missed this uh, hole in here. Risky if they pop up in there. On my way. If they pop up in there, like interesting angle, like in there, and then they mind control from the from the back there. Okay. Let's try this at least one turn. Location confirmed. Ice field, commander. Ice field, commander. See what we see. Hello. Ah, oh, sniper oh, shot wasted on that. The drones are the fastest, so. Target neutralized. Was that was that signal that something was there? Okay, uh, they are in a dangerous position, so I'm not, I will not have them there uh, anymore. Even that they kind of they opened their vision, <laughs> vision to any flyers from there. But uh, I think I will have just the rookies watch, and we'll have the overwatches from far back there. And uh, when they pop up, we will have uh, we will open these doors and. Uh, on my way. Blast him. Heading out. Mm. 
On the move. Moving to Overwatch. On Overwatch. Yes, sir. Буду на чеку. I'm watching. On Overwatch. Affirmative. Covering now. Affirmative. Covering now. On Overwatch. <laughs> Hear anything? Nice shot, rookie man. Don't die now, rookie man. Dodge! No, rookie man. Oh, it was Koopa. No. Well, that's what that's why they were here. They were giving us eyes. Game okay, Yambo. Why don't you go and uh, why don't you Position go and spot? Uh, of course, you can't see uh, see on that side. It was it was through full cover, so uh, we take that. Uh, on the move. Take the same cover. We know if we have eyes on there, then we finish it. Simba Kumba, the rookie with the coolest name. Should I open that door or not? I think I will. I've got a visual. Oh, hello. It means we could potentially get a visual on it next turn as well. Headed so let's now. hide. There's two commanders. Two commanders. Mechtoid. <laughs> okay, well that could have been worse. I should have opened the door. Luckily it chose the rookie instead of my guy. But uh, yeah, that could have been bad. But, uh, Mechtoid, why don't you eat some heat ammo? Oh, shit! The wall breaking like that was not part of the plan. Shit, 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 shit! Where did the rookie run? Okay, it ran there. Uh... Where did the Mechtoid come from? These doors are closed. Where did it... I have no idea. Super, super weird. Okay. Two commanders left. Um Location confirmed. Sorry, sorry Mabuza. You will go and take one for the team.
Heading out. There's this there's nothing as dangerous as the mechtoid anymore as far as something that can one shot us like that. Uh coming through the door, I mean. The sectoid commanders can do nasty things, but they can't uh they can't like outright kill us. Got it covered. Okay, mind control the rookie, please. Thank you. Almost got the auxiliary power banks charged, and I should be able to get one of the interior blast doors open. I'll send as many reinforcements through as I can before the charge dissipates and the door locks down again. Oh, hi. Hostiles pacified. Yeah, to, to one one rookie down, one rookie down gives us the. Can you, can you guys hear the heroic music? Cause we got this, we got this, boys. When you love us. Ha ha! I'm dodging your shots, boys. statement here today commander they came after us our people right at the heart of our operation and we showed them what happens now i think it's time we take the fight back to them good game good game the rookies rookies did their part Rookies did their part in uh, giving us eyes and took taking the shots we needed to take. Uh, the Mectoid could have killed one of us. The Mectoid could have killed one of us if it just chose to shoot my heavy. So, like, it was not flawless. It was not flawless, but it was good. Hang in there, soldier. Having to fight our own people. Will he be okay, doctor? Yes, I believe he'll recover. And more importantly, he seems to be free from outside control. Is there any indication of how this happened, doctor? I finished. Oops, sorry. Let's just crash the game. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Should have not clicked outside. Come on. Okay, please. Game. Game. Our troops are making it look oh, there easy we go. out there. Let's hope they don't get too cocky. Ah, fuck. Sorry I messed up the cutscene, guys. It was my bad. It's all good. It's all good, but I didn't want to mess up the cutscene. Game is a little finicky, finicky if I click outside the screen, but uh, all right, but that was good. Ah. Can I repeat the mission for another cutscene? Absolutely. Yes, I will. I will do that. Okay. So we have psionic testing, we have the exalt mission coming. Exalt mission coming and um uh, Yeah, just overall overall that could have not gone better. Well it could have gone better if we didn't take the mechtoid mechtoid possible kill on us. So that's 18. 18 critical is pretty brutal. Uh let's keep on scanning here. Until we get those soldiers. 
So also understand because then it's time to first of all get a new get a new Bible beep. And then uh, after that uh, after that name three new soldiers. So let's see if the stats are good enough. Aim 79, that is a keeper. Look at them in more detail in just a moment, but this one, this one is dismissed. They have a great will, but their aim was a little low for my. So they will uh, take. They will go and retire. And this by Bobby was an assault. Let's give them the give them the thing. Uh, I mean this one. So we go. And let's give them the ability, run and gun, there we go. Okay, then, new names. New names if these are good ones. 5371, that is a good starting point. Uh, it's not really great, like 59... 59 plus, like 60 plus could be best will. Aim could be as high as 80 plus. Uh, that is not a keeper. Uh, aim, aim could be better, and we don't need support. So uh, let's get them out as well. This is another assault. This is another assault. So I... <sighs> the fifty-three will is good, but I think this is a dismiss as well. Uh, we can do better. We can do better than that. Sell those. I don't think I need normal normal floater corpses, but uh, let's see. Ectoid cores we can sell. Seekers I think I was needing four. Soldiers six. Cause now we are farming. Now we are farming for the primes. So no 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 new names yet. We will get some. Uh not sure which glasses I, I would like, but uh, something something with high oh, yeah. So also even that we are heading into an exalt mission. And we are heading into an exalt mission, I think I will do. So I think if if Mickey Mickey gets the neural dampening, they will be fine, so they don't panic. Alright, oh, I need money for these, right? But they could get those, so it's, that's only that's only fifty. It's only fifty and then uh secondary heart could be great. The mimetic skin is also amazing, but I'm I don't think I will get that. Let's double check the double check that one. Did I need the floater corpse for something? All right, the floater corpse give the defense matrix. Yes, I definitely need those. We are not selling. We are not selling the floater corpses. Uh, these are needed for some projects. Project still. Alloys is pretty good. Mm. 
Now that we've got the firepower to match, I think we can take them. I'll sell these. I'll sell those and uh, let me see, cyber disk. Uh, I need two wrecks for the flight. And there is a boost module, so cyber disk, cyber disks are kind of good to keep. Drones, I believe I only need four more. Advanced flights. So that should be good. Uh, chrysalids can always be into use in the, using the plating We're really coming for down seekers. To the I could live without those, but let's see if I do that at 62. So I will give them the same, same I did for old croc, so that they don't panic anymore. They can't be mind controlled, and then uh, they have the, they have the good aim. I could give them uh, um, uh, I do want one mimetic skin, but I think I will give it to Assault instead of a Sniper. And we don't really need these, because we have Arc, Archangel. Uh, it's a bioelectric skin. Yeah, the second secondary heart is probably the only one I would maybe to get there, but uh, let's go with these. Excellent. We'll begin prepping the candidate for surgery immediately. I will notify you when the genetic modification process and is then, completed. Then uh, at some point, like if I, I think if I build a new mech and I upgrade it completely, it's pretty pretty expensive with all the all the level ups. I wish there was an option there to write directly build uh, directly build uh, level three. Just see the, what the whole cost is. Okay, there's the blast launcher. There's the blast launcher, and maybe now is time. Now it's time to take... Hmm. The Light Plasma Rifle would be a good training weapon. And we have collected some of those as well. I think I will just research that out of the way now. Uh, okay, how expensive was that? 337. Oh, and this takes the flight computers as well. Damn, I forgot about that. Okay. We will get this in the beginning of next month, I think. Yeah, and all the Illyrium. It is, it is expensive as hell. But um, it should be. It should be. But we can get it in the beginning of next month then. Uh, okay, let's continue researching. Or scanning, I mean. It's probably the Exalt mission that is coming. Yep. Excellent. We look forward to seeing your progress. Okay. I think now... I'll take basic cards on this. This gets old croc. Take Soul and Sheener. Mm. Fallen Yumi, and then uh, maybe I'll get these new guys. 
let's see, which was which was better? Bible Beep has they don't have high will, but they have high aim. Nether is actually pretty pretty good. Also, they were oh, but Nether has been leveled up, right? Yeah, they are already one level higher. Yeah, let's take them. Finally, I can just click to make items available. No, no more, no more item, uh, no more um, inventory management. Inventory, inventory management stuff. So they are all good. Laser pistol there, just for the heck of it. Uh, you good? Yeah, well, let's keep the grenade on you. We don't need to. You are all good. You don't need that one. Yeah, let's get you that, why not? You. Then you. Everyone is using the scopes. You don't really need scope, do you? Let's keep one medikit with us. Just in case something something nasty happens. Nasty happens and then you will take a scope. Alright, I think we are. I think we are good to go with that team. Plasmas all around. Yeah, I think we are good. But, uh, I will, uh, I will cut the video here for you guys on YouTube. So uh, I hope you enjoyed the base defense, base defense, and you can catch this exalt mission on the next part. So I'll see you there. Take it. Bye bye.